Hello and welcome to episode 13 of Half Moon Bay. We're going to start this episode... Well, okay, so here's the deal with everything. I'm not happy with this entrance. Uh, it gets really clogged up and I'm really not happy with the way that the, um, the train network turned out. So I think we're going to redo the these three sections where people live and uh, figure out a different way for them to get off of this freeway and into into where they need to go sounds good all right <laughs> so let's bulldoze a bunch of this and in fact we're going to redo our um a which call it um subway slash l train network so we're gonna do the whole the whole thing here hey that penguin good to see you man so let's start by taking out our train network so i like some parts of this and the parts that i like are well, actually, I, I suppose I really don't like much of what I did with the neighborhoods. So we're really going to just try to make them much, much nicer. Nothing like a little destruction to start off a Saturday. I think I'll be able to get nicer looking things in and more. Because the thing is, I, I tried to avoid the grid too much. And while, while it's not as, it doesn't look as nice, you know, like grid-like stuff, it does serve a, serve a good purpose in that it, um, you know, ensures a lot of uh, maximum density, you know. <clears throat> and and I lost out a lot on that because I'd prefer not to have to use a mega tower in this city to have enough people But I mean just knowing that I, I'm gonna have a lot of factories in the city. I, I'm probably gonna have to have it anyway Well, I actually I also want to take out like these entire little neighborhoods Because I need to remake them. Okay. I was like trying to be careful and I'm not sure why. <laughs> so this let's demolish. Oh, we can go all the way up to here. I actually kind of like how this is curved in though. So maybe I will leave it. Yeah, I'll leave what's up here. And I do like the way that's connected, actually. So I'll leave that. And then I'll take this out and I'll kind of try to make a grid out of this area. Kind of try to. This part, I'm not really sure. I, I have to come up with something. Stuff to bulldoze. I just need to waste less space. In an industrial city, I shouldn't be as, you know, like, <coughs> shouldn't try to be as artistic, I guess. I guess I wasn't really even trying to be artistic. I was just trying to make it look nice. <laughs> Oh, I didn't want to... Uh, Alright, I'll have to put City Hall back where I had it, because I actually did like where City Hall was. There we go. 
And I think the subway network over here is probably okay. Yeah, pretty much. We'll just have to figure out how to... Oh, but I want to take out the... Not all of the raised, though. Oh, I see there's subway under the road there. If I can grab onto it. There it is. See where these subway stops are. Okay. So I need to take this out. And I'm pretty sure I actually want the the upper train going there. That should work for now. So then, as I sip my coffee and ponder, <laughs> what do we do with this? And I want to try out a few things because we're actually I'm going to take this whole thing down because we can we can rethink this now that I accidentally demolished the. Um, Town Hall, because we can, we have this whole area to work with. Although I probably will just put Town Hall back where I had it, because I like it there. And, let's see. Is there any of this that is transition? No, okay. Cool. Just those. Alright. And... Oh. Yeah, I'll figure out a way to hook it in over there. Maybe I should start the grid pattern from right here. Make a... <coughs> Excuse me. I'll make sort of a sort of a brick thing. Um, here, let's figure this out first, because I would like it to all come into an avenue. So let's just use some of this space and try this out. So if we have an avenue like that, then I guess the best way to hook things into it. are these high-density roads. These one-ways. Because I think that the two-lane ramps don't look good coming into it. Yeah. Not very. Unless, what if we did something like this? Where they go in this way and would come out like that. It's not the greatest look, but it's different. There is a bit of a stoplight for some reason. Hmm, <laughs> thinking. Because the other thing I could do would be like this. I could do basically the same thing with the one-way streets.
if it would cooperate. Well, you do something like something like this. And so why does it create stoplights there? I'll have to I'll have to look at that and see if I can make it not create stoplights. But then these are the problem here too is that these are one way roads. Oh, I guess we could split it off here with the two-lane freeway ramps. If we did this, something like this, and then had them come in. We could do that. All right, let's, <laughs> let's figure something out over here. I kind of want it to come across this way. And in fact, maybe we'll do just that. But I actually kind of like that these two are not the same. Like they're they're not the same angle. Just a moment, I'm going to go refill my coffee. Be right back. Okay. Freshly gotten coffee. So let's try it this way. Let's back this off a little bit. And I think maybe what we'll do here is have one come in this way. And then the other, if it looks good, go up this way. It does look fairly good. for now because I'm not sure exactly where I want to connect those and again we're going to need one at an angle and one to go in straight so one at an angle be there And then hopefully I can get one to draw in straight. Or if not, actually I can just do it this way. OK. 
Okay. And the same over here, only it'll be easier because I can start from the correct spot. And then we're, we'll start this. So we'll do this with two lane freeway ramps because I know this is going to be a busy intersection. There we go. So this one's going to have to come in here. This one's going to have to go over here. And then these two are relatively just straight in. I mean angle too sharp. You were fine with it a minute ago. There we go. <coughs> now I will figure out this part. And uh, I'll clean this up in a little bit. I just wanted to get them connected for now. Let's see, this is going to have to come over here. Oh, that's right. Let's do this one first. Oh, no, wait. I have a little bit more distance there. Let's do this one first. Elevated ramp. We need to start farther this way. There we go. Yeah. 
interesting. Why is there a train there? <laughs> That's different. I should actually take the transition all the way in. <coughs> so that way it'll be um, nice and smooth. And then, we'll give that one a nice long distance. And go like that. Okay. Now, the harder part. We want to go from over here, which this is like this way, to over here. Am I still going to actually be able to use that? Not really. However, I don't usually, I'm not going to need most of that, so now I shouldn't have a problem. Transition up to it. And of course, since we have to go to level and then do our next jump, it, it's a little bit wavy, but that's the way the system works. So if I get one-way roads, but they have to be just a little bit wavy, I can live with that. Transition down. Two lane transition. Oh, come on. Why are you not grabbing on where you're supposed to? So then this part, I, I actually want to make, take up less room. So let's take this out. And draw it back in, going straight down. That penguin, I'm sure you're excited. Right off the bat, we get... Uh, Super happy fun road time, right? I can 
keep this flat. <clears throat> That's real, really where I want it. In fact, can I make that... It's an okay intersection, I guess. Yeah, it'll work. And we'll make that a curve. Well, it's a little better, but it's not. The textures aren't lining up like I want them to. What's that? <laughs> Weird. There's nothing there. This one can stay on the ground, like the other one. We just want it to come straight up from here. Actually, right about like this. Something like that. And then, of course, we have to merge these in. Mm, this isn't going to want to connect nicely. See, that one connected nicely. There we go. Okay. I guess that'll work. So I think that'll be able to carry the traffic much better.
Don't you? <laughs> Now I just need to figure out, what do we want to do for a grid? And I kind of like the idea of starting it here. And then it'll be off by up here, though. And, and I kind of like that, because then I can have some, some differently done buildings along the side of it, maybe. Let's try this here. Uh, and actually, we want the square one. Okay. Cannot draw. Th oh, does do I have a bus stop there or something? Of course I do. Of course I do. There it is. Okay, so if we start the grid out like this. Oh, that's weird. There we go. Yeah, and then we start going under here. And I like how this is kind of merging closer and closer. Oh, of course. And then I'll start doing the same over here, just kind of starting at a point that's close. And of course, we're not going to keep all of these roads, because I want to, you know, make traffic decent. That could be, yeah, that could work out good. So then this just needs to try to connect into here somewhere. Or maybe it, it actually goes up here and connects in in the middle of the road.
that's like this. Do I want it to go underneath like that? Or do I want it to go over the top? And I think... I think I do like it going underneath. I just need to um, straighten it out a bit. Then we'll take this road out, and this road out, and this road out, <coughs> and even that ground out again. And then this we can take across here. In a way like this. Is that about the same on either side? It's pretty close. And then make the corner here. If I draw into it, doesn't seem to want to make a nice grade, though. take the end off and we try to get the same nice smooth turn and grade there that's pretty nice those back now. And we will need to put the police station back. But I'm thinking we have this open space over here that might work for it. Oh, and we have to put the uh, city hall back in. Here. Yeah, that'll work. And then, then we can put our police station in, uh, this one. Because yeah, I think it'll actually work really well right here.
And then we'll turn these off. Till we need them. Okay. And then let's run the city for just a second. Let everybody figure themselves out. And let's dezone this stuff and this stuff and this stuff. Whoops. So this I'm worried about. Like I really don't understand what's going on here. Like, why are, why are there trains? Um, and I don't really want to redraw it, but I may have to. Oh, see, and then you just went up there. Hello, Tommy. Okay, so I'm going to have to redo this part of the intersection. It's just really weird. That the trains were up there. I, I really don't know why either. So this one has to go this way. Oh, whoops. And two-way transition up to here. And I totally made that going the wrong direction, didn't I? I did. Oops. We want this one to come from right about here and go over this way. And then we transition down over here. And we transition up right there. There we go. <laughs> Helps if you make things go the right way the first time. Now this one is going to be coming from over here. And, whoops, we want curved. Okay. Hmm. Actually, let's move that a little bit closer. Something like this. Because then we go down about here, and then we go down into here. 
Ugh, it just doesn't look good. Try it again. <laughs> I got this to work before, I will get it to work this time. Oh, and that's right, because I did it the other way. Alright. Let's do it this way first, then. Because I have more room over here. There we go. And then just a transition up. And we're good. <coughs> then we go over the top over here. Oh, going the wrong way, though. Okay, now we need to get a straight one, like a ramp going, and then transition. Again, lumpy, but works. There. Yeah, that'll work. Sorry, I, that was email from work. I don't have to answer it right now. Okay. What else am I forgetting to put back in? Other than people and stuff. I don't think anything. So let's let this run for a minute. And, like, overnight uh, for the game. <laughs> and see what we get for people. Because we, we want, you know, a ton of people commuting in and taking, you know, filling the jobs. And then once morning comes, 
We'll see what's going on here. And I think we should connect. this road like right here but it's only going to be for outgoing traffic and that's the same with this one we can connect them, but they're only going to be for people to get off the road there. And I don't even know if I want this one connected. Yeah, I think we're just going to take this out. And then this, we could connect up to here. To give lots of outs for this intersection. doesn't seem to want to connect nicely. Well, okay. So let's fill this with low wealth residents. <clears throat> because I do kind of like the mega tower there. It's not that awesome, but it's kind of neat to have and, and especially the way that, that this works out. Like, I really like that, that you can set that up <laughs> as, you know, an out and an out to go, you know, whichever way they want. And people can go in the tower here, so I think that worked out really nicely. So let's see what's going on here. We still have jobs there. And we have unsatisfied people. But I'm thinking that I'm going to put one more apartment level and then I'm going to put a mall and then a park level at the top of that. And why are there trains? There didn't used to be trains on this. I don't I don't get it. Where'd they come from? They don't seem to be messing with the traffic. Although I don't see any traffic really. Well, and I mean I know why they're there cuz it's the maglev and I know why they're those trains because the 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 Elevated train replaces the maglev stuff. But I've never seen it happen this way. It's so weird. Yeah, traffic seems to be going along it just fine. So 
So maybe I will have to, um, at the end of this, because I'm going to end this episode in uh, just a little bit. We're going to finish off this mega tower. And uh, I, I, after this episode, I'm going to go and double check my updates for um, my add-on or my, my mods that I have installed. And uh, yeah, just double check all that stuff because that's really weird. I've never, <laughs> never seen that. And I don't. I really don't want to rebuild all of that to to get it to work. We shall see what's going on here, though. <clears throat> and like I said, we're going to finish off this mega tower. Put a mall to top and then a park level, uh, a park um, uh, topper on it. Sorry, thank you, Shy Guy. My mic was muted. I must have hit the button. <laughs> um, so I'm going to finish the... Uh, I'm going to end this episode here. And I'm going to go and double... If you're watching live, I'm going to go and double check my mods and uh, make sure they're all up to date and stuff to see if I can't get those trains off the road, which is super weird. So anyway, thank you for watching. If you uh, like watching live, you can follow me on Twitch. at twitch.tv slash tinbeck. Or you can always watch all my stuff after the fact that I post on YouTube at youtube.com slash tinvec. I also have a website. A bunch of stuff is there. All the links to. So it's tinvec.com. So anyway, thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time. <laughs>